Okay, here we're at the last stage of our experiment. Uh, the tap water is pretty much, uh, there's no trace of it on the paper. I've uh, still got a trace of spring water on this paper. G Greenfield Naturals has the most uh, remnant left of water. Let's see what the next page looks like. Okay, as you can see, uh, Greenfield Naturals has a uh, presence of water right here spring water right there and there's the uh, tap water uh, from my perspective it's pretty much dry on the tap water spring water would be the next dry Greenfield Naturals has the most presence at the second sheet okay third layer third layer we see a little bit of a presence of water on the uh, tap water we see quite a bit on Greenfield Naturals and not quite as much on the spring water but almost Okay, here's the fourth layer. Fourth layer, we still have quite a bit of presence on Greenfield Natural spring water, a little bit on the uh, tap water. Okay, here's the, this is, let's see, this is the fifth layer. Okay, as you can see, let's move this down. We've got... Uh, an obvious presence on Greenfield Naturals, the spring water, and there is a bit of a presence on the tap water, but not as much. Okay, and last, the sixth layer, we still have more of a presence with Greenfield Naturals in the spring water, whereas there's very, very little for the tap water. And we go down to this level, and um, that's it. We're done. Okay, so what does this mean? I think what it means is that we saw the energized water as penetrating deeper and saturating more effectively uh, the layers below, whereas the, the uh, tap water, we saw less of a penetration down and more of an evaporation up into the uh, atmosphere, which is significant. This reflects what we, what we see all the time with our Greenfield Naturals energized water, and that is that you need less water uh, to water your crops. Less water goes farther. So for drought conditions, that's huge. As far as percentages go, what we've seen is anywhere from 30 to 75% savings on water, uh, or you could say a 30 to 75% more effectiveness in, uh, in, in water saturation to the plant, which of course results in uh, a healthier plant as well. Even though it's getting less water, it's getting more energy in that water as well, and uh, which is being transferred to the plant, which again results in enhanced productivity and health for the plant. It also works for people and animals the same way. Okay, that's it for this experiment from Greenfield Naturals. If you want to know more about us, check us out on the web. Thanks.